So here, just walk through the front door. We're greeted by a good sized living room here and gorgeous wood floors. Look at these things. Flows into the dining room, the wood floors do. Uh, refinished several years ago and still in magnificent shape. This is the living room that we're looking at right now. Just came through the front door. Everything's very nicely painted. We have a wood burning fireplace right here, wood surround, and a big bay window over here. These are wood pillow windows right here. These are the crank outs. Very, very nice windows. Windows on the corner of both of the room here. Great, great windows. Very ornate fireplace as well. So great living room here. And then this flows into the dining room. And a good sized dining room here. We have chair railing all the way around the room. So no matter where you put the table, the walls are protected. Another Pella window here as well. And here we get another look at those hardwood floors. Now, from right here, you go into the kitchen, and this kitchen is awesome. We're going to look at that here in a minute. Door to the upstairs, and the door down to the basement's right below that stair. And we're going to look at this chick kitchen. You're going to lose your mind when you see this kitchen. Bedroom number one. This is on the back left of the home, and there is a back door. There are three back doors to this house, and when I show you the back porch, you will see why. Ceiling fan in both of the bedrooms, which is very nice. Carpet in here is just a couple years old, and there is hardwood underneath this flooring as well. Updated six panel doors throughout the first floor here. Huge coat closet right here. Updated bathroom. This is all tiled floor. This is also a pillow wood window here as well. And then updated shower surround. Very clean shower. Shower tub, if you will. And backing out of here, over there to the right is where we just came from. That's the dining room. And we're going to swing around, check out bedroom number two. There is another linen closet right here, so we have two closets in the hallway. Good amount of storage. This is bedroom number two. We do have a ceiling fan in here, updated flooring. And this has a new window over here. That's a vinyl window that is new. And this goes out to the back uh, covered deck as well. Two closets in here. That's a kind of a, not a bifold, but opens two doors right there and then another door right there. So a good amount of cabinet space in here. And before we check out that back deck, which is off the hook. We're going to check out the kitchen, which is off. I'm sorry. I just get really excited when I see something this nice. Look at this kitchen. We have cherry looking cabinets, ceramic tile on the floor, granite countertops, tiled backsplash, granite windowsill, great hardware. Look at the rain hood. Gorgeous, gorgeous house. Gorgeous. I love this kitchen. Look at all this cabinet space over here and the little granite countertop. Looks like it was made for a Keurig coffee maker. Bunch of cabinets there and then we have a pantry cabinet on this side of the refrigerator as well. The refrigerator does stay as does the range. We do have a garbage disposal and the Maytag dishwasher stays as well. This is without exaggeration one of the if not the nicest kitchens I have seen in this neighborhood. And this does circle around into bedroom number one. And boom, we're in here. And that's the another one of the back doors. Uh, one car garage, and there is another back door in the garage as well. This door here takes us down to the basement, which we'll check out here in a moment. I'm going to give you some more footage of this kitchen. Just a gorgeous, gorgeous kitchen. Sorry, I'll stop talking about it, and we'll go out and check the back deck out which I'm going to go crazy on this as well because this is one of this is not one of the this is the nicest back entertaining area that I have ever seen in this neighborhood look at all of this this is all wood pretty much runs the whole length of the usable house this is vinyl soffit on the ceiling this is all covered for the most part it's all screened in 
And the backyard looks like something out of Better Homes and Gardens magazine. Storage shed here does stay. There's the garage door. You can get out into the backyard to the left where we were just at. Or there is another door over there. These are all candle lanterns. There's several of them all along the back deck here. There are lights. Back here there's electric ran out here. There's receptacles. Boom, boom, boom. Receptacles over here. <laughs> this is awesome back here. And the backyard is very nice too. Completely fenced. That's the door to bedroom number two that we saw. And then this takes us out into the backyard here. It, it, it's, it's like a bonsai garden in the backyard here. Great landscaping. Very, very private. This is an awesome entertaining house. And we do have a good strip of grass back here as well. Outdoor fire pit. That is all stone right there. If you want to barbecue, you can barbecue on your fire pit. Or if it's raining, you can barbecue on your grill up here. Awesome, awesome back deck. Next, I'm going to meet you upstairs, and then we'll go downstairs to the basement.